What's poppin' gamers? It's Gavin here, and in this video today, we're gonna be, you know, finding out whether a mechanical keyboard actually makes you better at the game, more consistent, or anything like that at Osu. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. So the first keyboard we'll be using in this video is the RK9300. So this is a keyboard I've been using for almost five months now. It has a Cherry MX brown switch. It's it's totally 100% stock, and you know. When I played with this, I noticed, compared to the other keys that we'll get into later in the video, this was significantly more fun to play with. It was more satisfying to click, it was a lot easier to tell when I had actually hit something, where on the other switches, it was a little questionable. Um, you know, with this switch, I found streaming to be so much more consistent. Other switches, streaming was so incredibly hard, just, I, I think it had to do with the fact of how squishy it was that my fingers never really knew when I'd be done, and they never really knew how fast to move because it was a totally different feeling. And you know, it's not like I played in the, I haven't played in them before. You know, I started off playing on uh, membrane and everything like that. It's just the mechanical keyboard is so much better to play on. And honestly, well, I did not get as good as a score. That was probably just all human error. But it was really, really nice to play on this keyboard. The next keyboard we have is that random generic Dell Office membrane keyboard you see everywhere. This keyboard is, you can get for like $5 on Amazon or whatever. This keyboard was, oh my god, it, ooh, it was terrible, okay? Listen, okay, you're playing with this keyboard, and it, it's like most membrane keyboards, if you press on hard enough, you can feel it in, but it's like, you, 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 no matter how hard I tried to press, I never felt it in. It was just trying to squish back up at me. It was like the worst feeling in the world. You know, they, they were super stiff. The feeling, whenever you tapped it, it was so fatiguing. And streams were, like, impossible to hit because of how fatiguing it is. And it's like, you had to be, like, pressing it like a, a, like a button or like a remote control. Like, you have to be individually pressing each one. So, like, you can single tap for the most part fine. But you cannot stream. It's just not possible. This thing is a nightmare to play with, and I th anything else would be better, okay? People say equipment doesn't matter. If you have a Dell Office membrane keyboard, equipment matters. This is actually the keyboard I played with for about four months, I think, before I got my uh, mechanical keyboard. With Cherry MX brown switches I use today, you know, this is a really a bad experience. It's just a little bit inconsistent. Screaming with it is super easy because, you know, you don't press down that far, um, and it, the, the switches are super, super light. It's just, my two biggest gripes with it is, you know, one, after repeated use of it, you're gonna constantly be smacking your hand into basically just a flat plate of plastic or metal, whatever your laptop is or whatever, and eventually that's gonna start hurting. It's like the issue with the Pro X Touch. What's gonna happen is you're just gonna keep touching this metal plate that doesn't really have any resistance. And you're going to start hurting your fingers, which is not great. And another thing with these, a lot of low-profile membrane switches have a tendency to just, like, not register hits. Um, you know, some of them, they can only register two kicks, keys at a time, which can cause an issue because uh, if you accidentally tap a third key, which a lot of people do while playing, they just won't register. And on top of that, sometimes they just don't register if you don't hit them properly. So they really make them the opposite of ideal for playing those two, so... While I did play with them for, you know, four months, I am would 100% strongly recommend playing with a mechanical keyboard. It's honestly such a better experience. These keys can be super frustrating sometimes, and I am very happy I switched because they are not worth the hassle they are. Well, what's the conclusion of this video? There really isn't a conclusion I can give. Um, just my opinion, so in my opinion, a mechanical keyboard of any kind, honestly, well, you know, it really depends from person to person, it makes tapping more consistent, and it makes the game way more fun to play. Um, you know, both of the membranes, they never really have the consistency that mechanical had, because mechanical is, they basically hit like 100% of the time, like n all the keys registered, but with membrane, it was kind of a gamble because of just the way that membrane technology works. So... Yeah, you know, it, it's all based on your opinion. In my opinion, I would much rather play in a mechanical. And, you know, that's a pretty popular consensus. Um, 
So, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, please subscribe and let me know in the comments what you guys want to see from me in the future video ideas. And I have a Discord and a Twitter. Be sure to follow me and join my Discord. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.